Most residents in Oshiwarongo's informal settlement depend on firewood for cooking and other energy needs, hence the reason to start a firewood business. On good days, I will make at least $1,000 or more. I do have challenges with a car that keeps breaking down when I go get firewood, but I am making good money. Shitumba has 11 employees who assist with collecting the hood while the women do the packing of firewood into bundles. Another man in the firewood selling business is Marley Paul, who says they are making a profit even though not all days are the same in business. I came from Rundu and I joined the wood selling business in December and it's going well so far. Customers come almost daily. On some days we get three and on other days we might get even ten customers. We are happy here. Oh, we used to struggle before we ventured into this business. When we started it wasn't easy. It was only after we built the shade for the firewood when the customers really started showing up. With the firewood business booming as customers come one after the other, these youth are fighting unemployment and hoping to serve as a motivation to others to venture into other types of businesses. Evelyn Paulus, NBC News, Oshiwarongo.